hello and welcome back to lighting gaming everyone so guys i decided to make this video to say so all the newer people to the game how you can make bullets quickly early game and also guys i decided to put in a little extra tip for you guys how to get brass super fast and get so much of it that you'll never be able to use all of it so yeah guys if you're new to the channel please remember to like and subscribe and now, let's get into the video. Alright guys, the first thing you're gonna need is nitrate. You can get that by mining it in the open world. You'll see it's actually super easy to find. And once you find it, you can just keep on digging on the same spot. And you'll keep finding more and more. You'll have a bunch of it in no time. I'm just showing you guys with a stone axe. But if you use a pickaxe, you will get much more and also if you use the minor 69er and mother lone perk you will get even more okay guys so with the nitrate we're gonna need charcoal which you can get all from burn trees but this is actually not the most effective way to get it but still you basically have an unlimited supply of coal you just need to go out there and start harvesting the burn trees once again guys, there's better tools to do this as well. I'm just using two stone eggs just to show you guys where to find it. So guys, once you have your coal and you have your nitrate, you can go into your infantry and you can start crafting gunpowder. Just remember guys, if you craft it in your hand, you're gonna be using two coal and two nitrate. But if you do it on a cam bench, you're only gonna be using one of each. So just keep that in mind when crafting the gunpowder. Now guys, this is the best way to get the charcoal. You'll see charcoal deposits all over the map as well, just like the nitrate. And it's just by far the most effective way to get it. If you use a decent pickaxe or something like that, you'll get way more than I'm getting right now. So you'll have a bunch of gunpowder in no time. Now guys, for the next one. The next one will be the lead. Now guys, there's a couple of ways to get a lead in the game. But my best way is just to go out there and mine it. The same way as you did with the coal. But you can also use like car batteries and stuff like that to get lead as well. So just remember that too. And now guys, for the brass. Now this is two tricks I want to show you how to get a ton of brass super easy. First way is to go to any car and start breaking it with the hands. You'll see every now and then a radiator will drop. Now if we throw that radiator in the fort, more than 200 brass from a single radiator. And trust me guys, if you're out there just destroying all the cars you find with a hands, you end up with a bunch of radiators really quick. But guys, if you take your duke coins and you put them in the fort you'll see that each one of your duke coins will give one brass as well so that's for me by far the most effective way to getting brass because if you just go and sell everything that you have extra to the trader you'll end up with 20,000 duke coins in no time and 20,000 duke coins equals 20,000 brass as well so yeah guys that is by far the two most effective methods of getting brass that I know about. You're welcome. If you know a better way, please reply in a comment. But yeah, guys, this is a pretty good way. Now, guys, once you made the bullet taps with lead and the bullet casings with the brass and the gunpowder as well, you're just gonna head over to your workbench and then you're just gonna select the bullet you want to craft and then you're already ready to craft. It's really that easy to get the bullets and you can end up with a bunch in no time. Thank you everyone for watching, see you all in the next video.